So I believe this is part three of my daddy's cool stuff. So let's see, we got oh God. this is my dad and I don't know what. He must have been drunk, which is rare, but it's just too weird. He's got little shorts, looks like something out of an English Navy or something. That's funny. That's some, obviously some weirdness while he was with Jeannie Marie. There's my dad. That's about how he looked when I lived with him for a couple years. He was always mad. We did not get along. Hey, look, here's an early picture of him. Hoffman Studio. 30 East Adams Street. Here's the phone number. That's a brown and white. How cute. Three stripes and a bird. Oh, my dad taught at the Griffith Observatory and Planetarium in California. And this is the little certificate that we give for the navigation course. Look, here's a whole bunch of slides. My dad used to love to do slides, and I think they fell asleep during all their shows. I need to do some prints off of these. There's the old slalom boat. Wow. May 1973. <laughs> this may be one of the ships my dad was on. I know he was on an aircraft carrier. I think it was called Scorpion. There's one. With old radar stuff on top. Now, he said he was on that boat that I had that hat for. Um, oh, who is this? This is not us. Because my mother's not anywhere in there. I don't know who all these other people are. They kind of look like me, but no. But that's my dad right there. But that's not us. My mother is very Marilyn Monroe y, you know. Lieutenant Miller. See detail officer. See the detail officer. Sounds like somebody was in trouble. I don't know who that is sailing that Hobie cat. That's a dual hole. It's not trimaran. It's two holes. They're kind of lame. That's probably from the 70s. Look at that wave. Oh, he taught the, um, they called him to do, you know that, I think it was like Hawaii Five O or whatever, um, where they ride the canoes in on the waves. My dad supplied the canoes and then taught them how to do the canoes into the waves. Those are all Hobies. That might have been in Hawaii in the 70s or something. He'd had a sailing school up there too. Transportation Security Administration. Baggage inspection. Wow, this is an old picture of my dad. I think that's my dad right there. That's my mother right there. Look at this. Elizabeth Peggy Miller is on her shirt. See that? How funny. That's my mom. 
very saline looking there. My baby sister wore that same kind of hat. The one that kind of looks like Gilligan's Island. There's some people that are teaching how to make knots. Man, that's a long time ago. My dad wearing a flat top. So that would be in the Long Beach Marina. I'm going to date on that picture. My mom doesn't look very flashy there. There's her wedding ring. She pawned it, got it back, and I took all the good diamonds out of it. Oh, we got two pictures of those. Their wedding pictures are great. I'm still trying to get them because um, he puts them aside for me. That's that same little picture. Is there a date on that? I let you do pro pictures and not put dates on them. There's a whole bunch of these. I got all of them. It's because nobody likes my parents but me. I don't know who this is. I don't, I don't know that that's my dad. And that's probably... That's probably in Long Beach. I would venture to say. I don't think that's Marina Del Rey. There's somebody flipping a Hobie cat in the wind. Well, that party's over. And I don't know what this picture is supposed to be. It's probably one of my grandma's pictures. She probably did a needlepoint of that or something. Let's see what this is. My dad is a picture person, that's for sure. Here's my dad. He got into photography really, really big. And he had all the Nikons and the, um, I can't think of the other cameras he had too. But he liked Nikons and he had underwater Nikon. We could literally take it in the pool underwater. That's my dad with his longer hair. Let's see if he has a mustache there. Yeah, he does. He has a mustache there. And when he went to Europe, they, um, that's probably on the Ericsson teak. Who's the girl with the boobs? Let's see. That would be Jeannie Marie. So that's probably around the 70s. Um, no, wait, it says 994. That's not my writing. Man, my dad looks terrible there. Those short shorts. My dad always wore shorts to his knees. Look at this fish. Big old marlin. Yeah. Oh, you know what? That's my Aunt Roseanne. Roseanne Cash. She used to love to go to Mexico and go fishing. And then she never got the fish. They got given to a restaurant or whatever, but she loved fishing. That's probably in the 80s. How funny. She's real heavy there, but she used to be real thin. Here's my dad. Yep, that's how he looked when I was a kid. Mad. <laughs> Another picture of my dad. That is probably... Oh, let's see. I don't think that's Catalina Island. That could be like Hawaii. And that is... That looks like that's on Zeus. On this big black boat. No pictures. Look, here's my dad. This is the fake picture they do at that ship. And you stand in front of the picture and like put the picture together. So there's my dad. Taking that picture. <laughs> Isn't that funny? Oh my gosh. Here's me and my baby sister Katrina. And the ponchos my mommy made for us. And my Chrissy doll. I miss her. I want another Chrissy doll. And we had hair down to our butts. And uh, this is. This looks like in my grandpa's backyard. Where would this be? I'm trying to think of what tree that is. 
That's probably my grandpa's backyard. But that's a picture my dad took. Wow. He didn't get to see us too often until we moved in with him. Here's my dad when he came to Palm Springs. I think Sonny Bono was the mayor then. And this is us playing chess in the game room at the apartment building we lived at by the golf course. And there's my dad. I'm playing chess with him. I was big time in chess because my mother was really good in chess. And no one, I mean no one, could beat my mother in chess. But this is me, right there. With hair down on my butt. My mom used to always say, don't ever cut your hair so I'll, I'll, I'll always be able to spot you guys in life. Oh, I gotta get this stuff picked up. And roll it off in the storage. See what all this is. Student report card. Look at this guy's grades. B minus C. C. And he was on me so bad. Algebra 4. 19 and 50. April 9th, 19 and 50. My mother's birthday is April 11th. Satisfactory, satisfactory. I think I read this before and he had like a D on something. And he, Lincoln School. Oklahoma City Public Schools. Hmm. He was so on my grades, you'd think he was an A student. Days present, 14. Days absent, 12. Times 33. Jeez, on the second nine weeks. Hmm. Looks like we spent more time sailing than we did at school. Midshipman P.J. Miller, 10 South Row, Pryor, Oklahoma. Okay, so I know Row Street. That's down in Pryor. And uh, that was probably his mom's house. And then his mom and her sister, Pearl McCulloch, uh, lived together for a long time, but they never got along. 1954. First, let me congratulate you on a fine team. Navy, who will be playing in the Sugar Bowl New Year's Day. Oh, this is a story about my grandma. Girls' curiosity about dolls results in a hospital museum. Because my grandma's a big time doll collector. I don't know. That's in New York. Chance of a lifetime litter. Wounded by the Bood War. I was wounded in the Bood War. Where that is. That may have been some of the stuff I found in the garage at Mount Rosanna's because I mailed him a bunch of stuff. There's another report card, something that was written. Destiny James Miller, 100 Northwest 24th Street, OK City. 1943. Report card. Look at this. Ceremony read for Miss Roseanne Cash Miller and John David Cash. And that's a joke. Southwestern Bell Telephone, $8.56 in 1958. Oklahoma Publishing Company. News I think that's a newspaper. Yeah, a newspaper. Two dollars sixty cents. Mercy Hospital, Oklahoma City. Fifty six dollars. Some bill for my dad. None of us were born there, so 
Yeah, there's probably all the stuff I found in Roseanne's garage. I was sending him a bunch of Xeroxes. I Xeroxed them at the office and put them back in the garage. Which I, I should have took all that stuff and shipped it to my dad back then. But I kept running across all this really cool stuff. It was mostly boxes, my grandma stuff, that Roseanne had over there. Another cheers to my dad. No, so Ensenada raised 1977. I got drunk there at San Diego Yacht Club and fell off the dock during the eclipse. Yeah. I always wanted to go on the Ensenada race. Police, Honolulu Police Department. I got it for my dad. Miller Lite. Jimmy Buffett. My dad loved Jimmy Buffett. He liked playing him on the boat. That was an old sailing book. This is probably another one of my dad's books. The All England Series Sailing by E.F. Knight. Hmm. Okay. This is a picture of my dad, I'm sure. Oh, my mom loved my dad better than Roseanne. That's for sure. Snowflakes are kisses from heaven. I got that. There's some cool Navy stuff I got. My dad. Neat, huh? The Navy belt. That I got for me, but I created my dad's stuff. This is probably my dad in a christening gown. I'll make you bet. You know, they put them on boys, too. There. Got my dad some $100 soap. No. I think that's game cards. Playing cards. Yeah, that's playing cards. With Ben Franklin on it. You know the Cadillac thing. Look, here's all these navy buttons. And then an ID bracelet of my dad's. Probably while he was in the Navy. Playboy button. He probably got that from going to the Playboy Club. My mother was a waitress at Playboy Club, too. I used to have her necklace and I lost it one night drunk. Or somebody took it off my neck. I don't know what happened. That's one of the reasons I don't drink anymore. Pretty cool, huh? Water depth. Choctawahachi Bay. U.S. Air Force Mission 2020. This is one of my dad's Navy hats. Desmond's. Looks so old. Gotta take it. I'm sure you wear that for your house. Photo shoot. Beep. Miller Squadron. I got that for my dad. <laughs> Probably from one of the bars I worked. Probably got it from a distributor. Miller High Life can. I use it to fertilize my yards. That makes it the stuff that I put in my grass and makes it really blue green. But I gotta use beer with it. And then my dad sent me these. Um, I guess it was like an 05. 2005. I got two of these really cool Goodyear blimp things. In California you used to see the Goodyear blimp flying over all the time, but they're really dangerous because of the gas. I bet I'm not going to get this thing out of here. This is from Sears. It tells you all the components of the airship and all that kind of stuff. I don't think it's coming out. Maybe. Oh, look. Goodyear blimp. And it's heavy, too. A 
I used to see that all the time flying around California when I was a kid. You'd see them. They're supposed to be ultimately dangerous. You can go on them and eat. You get to eat. Take a trip on them. If you have, like, really big money, I guess. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. Yeah, so I got two. I believe you sent these to me. It's probably one for each one of my kids or something. But anyway, now we can pack it all up. And this is a special box. From the Naval Academy Water. Yep. Anyway, thanks for helping me unpack that because it's time to pack it up and put it in a safer place. Talk to you guys later. Well, I'm sure the captain enjoyed you looking at all his goodies. Have a great one, everybody. Love your parents. They're only around one time. One time. That's all the time you get. Talk to you later.